mean, today is like rainy out and not disgusting, so I really don't know what to do with my time. I'm gonna sing a song that expresses my love for Judy. Every time I hear that song, it reminds me of Judy's precious face. I can't help myself. I can't help but smile. Every time I see I was pretending that stuffed animal was Judy. That song was by Jenna McCurdy, and let me tell you, her looks are as high as Judy looks, so let me tell you, it's pretty smoking. But I still love Judy with a burning passion, and let me tell you, one day we'll be together, one day we'll be married. <gasps> I swear! Oh my gosh, I came up with the best idea. Even there's, it's raining out and there's nothing to do, I'm gonna make food for Judy. Hmm, let me think. What would Judy like? Hmm, let's see, what would a girl like? Well, my mom's a girl, and she loves buttered mushrooms. Let me tell you, she's gonna love these buttered mushrooms so much. <laughs> My mom told me that if I eat too much butter, I'm going to end up being as fat as Kevin, but I don't care. I love butter even if it's fattening. Time to cook this delicious food inside of my brain. I really don't want to talk about it too much, but a few years ago, an animal died inside my microwave, so my mom still don't have the money to buy a new one, so we still have that one. But it's okay if an animal died inside a microwave, because now, that animal soul is looking down on our food and guarding it. Sometimes when I'm bored, I talk to the animal soul inside the microwave. It responds to give me advice about problems that I have. Alright, all done. The mushrooms are all done, and I bet Judy's gonna love them so much that she'll love me. I'm also gonna give Judy a frozen TV dinner. If you're wondering why I'm giving her a frozen TV dinner, because we don't want to waste electricity using a microwave, so we eat TV's dinner frozen. And let me tell you, everything tastes better frozen. Okay, that's all I'm gonna make for Judy, because I don't want her to turn into a fatty magic. Judy, are you in there? Judy, it's Fred. Answer the door. Hey, here's some feed for you, lovely girl. Oh my gosh, Fred, that food is so disgusting. Please tell me you're joking. Go away. Someone likes the food I made. Aw, you're such a good squirrel friend. Okay, I'm back inside because it started raining really bad. Hopefully the rain will leak through the roof of Judy's trailer. Maybe that will learn Judy a lesson or two. I spent so much time making food for Judy and she didn't even eat it. Whatever. I bet if I made food for Jenna McCurdy, she will love it. Peace out, home dog, and the thing I learned today, you should always spend time making food if you're for sure that person who made it will eat it. Bye.